As many of you guys will already be aware, there have been many eras of fashion in Royal High. Throughout the many different years that we've been playing the game, people style their outfits in different ways, which obviously has caused Royal High to update along with the times and remodel many of the older items that no longer fit with the vibe of the game. This includes reworking a lot of different heels, which are of course one of the main staples for fashion within the game. Today, we are going to talk about all of the heels that have had reworks and the things that have been added into them and talk a little bit about the different toggles added to some of the newer items and some new reworked heels we have to look forward to in the future. Hello wonderful little beans, my name is me and welcome back to my channel. Before we get started, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and click that bell. And of course, don't forget to use Stacker B when buying Robux or Premium. Today I'm joined by Iris again, hello. Hi. You guys, Iris is like one of the most like used healers by Iris. Is actually the Dear Dolly heels and that's non-ironic by the way, she actually likes them. And um, since the rework came out, I feel like, you know, I can use some of the toggles, but she actually wears the original heels. even before Wait, the rework came no. out. Yes, you do. I you mean, did. yes, true. But I am not using the first dog. I'm using the one where the, the thing is. What's it? The, the ribbons. The ribbons are gone. But, but prior to the rework coming out, you still used them. Yes, so, for sure. yes, of course. So, you know, you like <laughs> weird things. But you guys, we're going to talk a little bit today about all of the heels that have been reworked in the game. And we'll talk a little bit about their um, toggles as well. Now, I'm sure there's a good chance I will miss some of them. So if you guys want to let me know in the comments down below, feel free if I have missed any. And I will ask my editor, I'm going to be a pin and ask them if they can pop a picture up for you of the old style of the heels throughout the video for the ones that have an old style. Some of them don't. There aren't that many. And the ones that don't have an old style, um, because you can still see the original version in the game. We won't need to pop up. I think there's only a couple that will actually have to pop up the old style. But you guys will get to see the old version as well. So first things first, we will start with the Dear Dolly heels. Obviously, it makes it easier because Iris is already wearing them. Can you toggle them back to the first toggle, please, if you don't mind? And while Iris does that, um, I'll just mention that the give... original heels had no toggles, you guys. There were no toggles whatsoever on the original heels. Actually, they were completely Let plain. me make this faster. <laughs> yeah, just re-equip them. The original heels had no toggles, you guys, and then when the heels came out, they added toggles for you to change the different pieces. So this was the original, as you can see, with the ribbons coming down, and then, like, they've got, like, these cuffs around above the knee. I can't remember what these are actually called. They have a name. It's like, the garters. That's the one, garters. Um, can you toggle on the, the second toggle, please? Um, they added different mm. toggles for you to remove the ribbons. They added a toggle for you to remove the garters, and they added toggles, I think, so you can have, like, a different style of ribbon, right? That goes around your leg, and you can also take the socks off i think now as well just feel free to cycle through them yep so there's the ribbons as you can see now do bear in mind we do not have the new toggle system yet as when we're recording this video so it's taking a long time to toggle through hopefully the new system when the update comes out will be much much better by the way you guys i apologize if my voice sounds a bit funny i am feeling a little bit sick so for these ones we don't need to pop a picture in of the original heels because you can still wear the originals if you want to in game they are still the first toggle for the heels before you toggle through them so even though the rework did come out they are not that different is there an option that has a no like ribbons or anything or is it just is that the lowest you can get with like stuff not being there no that that this is really the barest version of the, yes. the other heels you end up with something on your legs either socks garters or a ribbon basically but there are options yeah. so at least you have some options there for you to wear and i'm gonna ask iris because we'll do these two at the same time to put the cookie cutter loafers on because as you guys will know the cookie cutter loafers and the snuggly booties both had a rework released shortly after they were already released you may remember that the original release of the heels of the shoes were that the snuggly booties were but like this, just snuggly booties and the click of the loafers wear like that with like these big socks. As you guys can see, there was a toggle already for you to remove the big fluffy socks on the cookie cutter loafers, I believe. Yep, it was already in there. And whilst they are technically slightly custom legs, they are mainly just the Roblox leg. You may remember that shortly after, they did add an option for you to toggle them into big girl legs. So essentially, you can toggle them with leggings as well, or you can toggle them into the big girl legs modes. Both of them had these big girl legs released at the same time. And you may remember, I actually really loved when they added this option. I used to wear the two Two turned leggings for the cookie cutter loafers all the time. But one of the things that I really, really like about these being reworked is that lots of us don't like to use Roblox legs anymore. A lot of us like to use custom legs or the big girl legs, what they call it in the game is big girl legs at least. Because obviously, when you use the Roblox legs, it's hard to get it to go with your outfit. It makes you really short and it kind of makes you look like you're still wearing chicken heels. I like having the option to make the big girl legs instead. They just look a lot better. So when the rework came out for those, you'll remember I made a lot of videos on them because I really liked them and I wore them 
bottom with a lot of my outfits and still some of those outfits that I've got saved still have these shoes in them. I ended up liking like the December's Dream heels and the new Goddess of Triumph heels better, but there are still sometimes, especially Christmas outfits, where I tend to wear these because they're wintry and they're snuggly and they're perfect for those type of outfits. Not to mention, I'm pretty sure we got most of them in Advent, making them free. So, you know, personally, pretty ideal, really. Out of the two, Iris, which do you prefer? I never use the snuggly booties. I tend to just use a cookie cutter loafers in my outfits. I guess we'll see I how you feel in winter. Because the snuggly booties I do, than I, outfits. Yeah, I do use... I did, I did use the snuggly booties for a, like a bedtime outfit that yeah. I had to delete the other day <laughs> because I needed more outfit slots. I've had to just delete a bunch of outfits as well, lol. So next up, we're going to talk about the action booties. Now, I don't know, do you have these, Iris? Um, I believe you gave them to me. Well, because I'm going to... My game is yes. broken. <laughs> I can no longer move my camera. My camera's broken and it's no longer moving. So you're going to have to show them instead. So you guys may remember the Yay. action booties are one of the older chicken heels. They used to have chicken heel rendered legs as well. So I'll pop a picture on of what they used to look like on screen. Now, Barbie reworked them so that they were technically the first early version of custom legs. So as you can see, the legs are shaped, but they are still short and stumpy, so people don't really wear them. And it's still got a significant lack of a proper knee inside of the heels. But when they were first to be wrecked, people were really excited about them because they were the first proper heels to not be chicken legs. So, you know, it's pretty cool. I mean, they still go pretty well with those old skirts if you want to wear them over those old <laughs> skirts. So the action booties were very nice when they got reworked. Then I'm going to ask Iris to put on the cherry blossom sandals if possible. Um, the Cherry Blossom mm -hmm. Gator mm -hmm. Sandals were reworked in March this year, you may remember. Uh, the reason for that was because before they didn't have like flowers on them and stuff, and especially the masculine version, and they reworked them to have flowers on. I don't know why anybody would wear them because the legs that he uses with them are so ugly. But should you want to, there is a toggle to remove the flowers and add them, and before, there were just no flowers. So nice and unique and exciting for you to wear. Now, lastly, we have the Batmo heels. Now, I think I can't get changed. Oh, no, I can't even go and dress up, so it's completely broken. So the Batmo heels, you, you can guys... can use the Batmo heels. There you are. There they are. Iris is wearing them now. The Batmo heels were, for some reason, really, really popular for the last couple of years, probably because a lot of people forgot to buy them during Halloween, and then when they went off sale, they didn't have them. The problem with the Batmo heels is that as of this recording, the update hasn't come out yet, but by the time you're watching this, it's probably already been out, and there will now be 38 Eight different toggles for the Batmo heels. So pretty exciting, you guys. You've got a lot of options there. You can really, really mix up with the Batmo heels now. And I think the old version still looks nice. As long as you don't mind being really short, but it is nice now that we have options. And I'm glad that those options are there. Especially 38 toggles. That is a ridiculous amount of option. Now, you guys, yeah. I don't know if there are any more heels that have been reworked. So let us know in the comments down below. But from mine and Iris's memory, these are the ones that we can remember. And I'm looking forward to seeing all the Batmo heels toggles or the 38 i'm so glad they changed the toggle system because the glitchy toggle system we have now would take like an hour to get through all those toggles that would be literal madness i don't know about you iris but my toggle menu really really breaks a lot so yeah this happens to me a lot when i cycle through toggles too much and i have to switch servers when that happens yeah if you do it too no, much it just breaks completely enough. And then you have to rejoin the game entirely, which is really ideal. So, little beans, let us know in the comments down below which was your favorite heel rework in the game and which heels would you like to see reworked next? Let us know in the comments down below and thank you so much for watching. Oh, actually, I just thought, quick note, the Winter Guardian boots are getting an extra toggle. So, technically, it's going oh. to be a rework dial because they're coming out soon. But as of right now, they're not out yet when we're recording this. So, it's another one that will have a rework eventually and we will show it as soon as I don't have them anymore. It's okay. We'll show them as soon as they come out. <laughs> Hopefully, it won't be too long. With that said, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and click that bell. And we will see you guys next time. Have a good day, everyone. Bye. Bye. Bye.